Welcome to Headway 101. My name is Corey Freeman and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the Headway Themes Carnegie template. Let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is fix my menu. As you can see there are too many pages and so it doesn't quite fit. That's simply solved by going into the WordPress administrative dashboard. Here I've got menus. I'll select main menu. And I'll assign it to the primary navigation. Click save menu. And you're good to go. Again, this is found under appearance menu. So you just choose the menu you want or create an entirely new one and you can drag and drop to rearrange. If I view the site, you can see that everything is in its proper place now. Next, I'm going to fix my logo. I'll go into the visual editor in grid mode. As you can see, this layout is using a template. I'll click this drop down box, shared layouts, and edit the home. I'm going to drag the navigation block to the right and then make the header block a little bit wider. It looks like that was enough of a resize to make everything in the right spot. Now down here where it says the waiting is over by this template, that's not the text I want to use. So I'll scroll down to the text block that says promo banner and open up the block options. I can edit the content here. If I click this HTML tab, I can see all the HTML that they're using for this particular design. So I'll go ahead and just replace the waiting is over with, I don't know, let's see. Buy this one of a kind course. I'll change the text. And so that's how that works. I could also get rid of it completely by deleting this text block if I wanted to. Down here I can see I have a no widgets. I can change up the widgets that appear by going into Appearance, Widgets, and clicking and dragging. And if I reload, my widgets show up over here. Now the widgets above it are actually different listings blocks. I can reorganize those by clicking and dragging, or I can delete them completely in favor of the widget block. Just a side note, this popular posts is listing posts and sorting them by the comment count in descending order using a listings block. So it's fairly easy to recreate. Also, I'm using a static front page under WordPress settings and then reading. You can see here. If you click on the blog page, you can see that it says just another WordPress site. 
along with those widgets that were there before and a listing of my posts. I can edit that by going to Shared Layouts, Edit, Index, and Single. I'll go ahead and get rid of this particular promo banner wrapper this time. And I'll get rid of this recent posts and categories listing. It's listing the category. Oh, hang on, I'll show you. It's listing the categories by selecting listing type and using taxonomy with the taxonomy be with the taxonomy being categories. You could also use custom taxonomy for custom post types here. Oops. Obviously, as you can see, I deleted too much that last time. I'll move these up. Okay. If I want to change the colors and the images, I'll go into design mode. Still, I'm editing the template. Okay. Which totally doesn't like me right now for some reason. I'll go back into design mode. All right, you can see that where it says currently editing front page, it says to edit this layout, remove the shared layout. Um, I'll click on the shared layouts and edit home. And this way I can edit the colors. For instance, the site title. Maybe I'll change it to purple. This is just a slider block, so to change these images, I would upload my own from my desktop. Or I could use images in the media library. They have captions on them that use HTML, but I could always type in my own. It's usually better to do this in grid mode because it's saving every time I hit a button, which is why you've got that delay. So, okay. One final thing I'll show you is if you wanted to edit the front page, you could actually just remove the shared layout and then click edit and you can clone from one of the shared layouts in order to build your own layouts using those default blocks. That's pretty much all you need to know to work with this particular Headway Themes template. Check out headway101.com for more tutorials on working with templates and with Headway themes and WordPress. I'm Corey Freeman. Thanks for watching.